What up, world? It's your boy, B.A. For Real 100, and welcome to Get Your Bars Up Media. Salute, salute, salute. Mm. So, shout out to East Oregon Battle Coalition. Yes, yes. I just up to y'all channel, too. Just up to y'all channel. But I was sent a goodie from this battle league. Um, the battle I'm talking about is Spaz versus Charlie Aztec. Now, if y'all haven't heard about either one of these battle rappers, well, in the Northwest, they're getting it popping. They jump, they're getting it jumping out here. Yes, yes, yes. They're getting it jumping out here. And I had to I had to recap this battle. I had to recap this battle. Um, getting into that first round, man. Um, Spaz goes first. Spaz is lyrically, is is damn near a lyrical genius. You feel me? Even like as far as how he used and manipulate words, he's on another level with it. And man, super duper dope. But in the, the crowd was not trying to rock with Spaz. I don't know why they wasn't trying to rock with Spaz. They weren't trying to give him no love. But I forgot. You know, when you from West Seattle and you going out to a whole nother state and the person that you're battling is from that state and that's their home league and all of that stuff, of course, it's going to be a lot of gas for the other person. But with that being said, um, Spaz did well that first round. I liked him. I liked him. I felt like he was he was kind of tiptoeing, like trying to fill out the, the the battle, like he was trying to go uphill with it. And uh, with that being said, Charlie came in, and I believe that Charlie came in and did his thing the first round. I, I actually, I was feeling his energy. Um, wasn't really too lyrical, but his energy was cool. But once again, it was a lot of gas in there, meaning that this round was debatable. But I edged that first round to Charlie. I got to get a first round of Charlie. I got to edge it to him. And the only reason why I say that is because of the energy. And I guess the crowd made the round seem better. So uh seemed super duper nice because everybody was going ham. And I'm listening and I'm trained. I'm a trained listener. Uh, but this it's a lot of skeptics around uh, this particular battle or two, uh, that being Charlie Aztec, because he is like, a, a, I guess it's Charlie Aztec, AK King Recycler. That's what I heard. And I'm not trying to disrespect you, sir, but I heard that you be recycling and you be stealing bars. And I, if you stole any bars in that first round, you lost. You automatically lost. You're supposed to be putting off for the Northwest. But anyways, if you did write that, then what I can say is, hey, man, that was... That was a dope first round. That was a dope first round. But with that being said, I got it. I got Spaz. I mean, uh, I got Charlie edging the first round. Getting into the second one, second round. This is when Spaz takes it to another level. This is when he takes it to another level. I think he actually blacks this round. To me, to me, this was my ah, ah, fire, fire. Shout out to Tech Nine. If I had, if I had a lighter, I would put it up and be like fire. Uh, anyways, um, with that being said, I, I got I, I, Charlie jumps in. Charlie starts spitting too, but you can tell that he wasn't prepared in his, for a second and, and even his third because he was stumbling. He had to keep bringing bars back, and he actually cut his round a little short. Um, I don't want to call it a choke because it was a solid round, but with that being said, I got Spaz clearly winning that second. Mm -hmm. I got Spaz clearly winning that second. Getting into the third. Um, Spaz goes again and Spaz picks up where he left off in the second round. And you could tell he throw a little freestyle in there. He bounced back in and out. And it was people hating on him in the crowd. It was people hating on him in the crowd. Let the man rap. Let the man rap. But anyways, I think Spaz did well in the first, in, a, uh, in the third third round, man. He actually, I, ah, with that being said, I'm not even going to recap the rest because Charlie did his thing too. Charlie did his thing in the third, but I think Spaz clearly won that third as well. So I got it 2-1. Um, Spaz winning the second and third round. I think the first round is debatable. And um, if rumors are true, because I did see some footage of some recycled things too from Charlie, uh, then it's a 30. But I got it 2-1 Spaz, uh, debatable 3-0. And uh, yeah, they both came with it though. They both came with it. And I think both of them did well as far as their presence. Uh, but what I'm gonna need y'all out there to do for me, especially the ones that's been rocking with me and actually watch my content and everything, salute to y'all, is check out this battle and tell me what you think about both uh, both artists in general. Uh, because I like them both. And I think both of them got the potential to to put to, to jump on and uh, and actually put the Northwest on, similar to what Stewie Newton is doing, uh, similar to what Jay, is Night, Jay the Nightwing is doing. And yes, I said Jay the Nightwing. I know he choked. I know he choked his last couple of battles. I know it. 
but y'all still fuck with him because he fire. <laughs> exactly, exactly. But anyways, this is your boy BA for real 100. This is Get Your Bars Up Media. If this is your first time here, click that subscribe button. You rock with me, I rock with you. And if you out there hating, just because you think I'm a new guy, you think I haven't been doing this and I've been doing this for a minute and you just hating just to hate, ha! Ah, then all I can truly say is thank you for coming and get your bars up. Salute, subscribe, all of that good stuff. Tell me what y'all truly think about these two artists and about this battle in general. And hey, Battle Coalition, East Oregon, I see y'all. I see y'all. Drop some more content, man. If it's fire, of course I'm going to recap. But salute to everybody out there. Holla at your boy. I got to get back to work. Salute.